Hi Cancer, thank you so much for watching this reading. Let's see what cards are showing up for you this week. And we get the Seven of Swords, the Knight of Pentacles, the Seven of Pentacles, the King of Swords in reverse, the Queen of Swords, the Four of Cups in reverse, the Five of Pentacles, Six of Cups, Eight of Cups, and the Ace of Wands in the end. That's a beautiful combination. So you're waiting for something to happen because you don't have the knowledge about something. You really need to understand something better, you need to know how something works. And you are in the past, you was pretty clear about something, like, okay, this is what I experienced before, I know how it works, this is pretty logic. Uh, could be about your partner, could be about, uh, yeah, that this partner is still interested in you, maybe you're waiting for them to respond to you in some way but this could also be about money this could be that you're waiting for amount of money coming in and you also understand that you are pretty uh, wealthy at the moment or you have more money than you think so uh, there is something coming up with money for you and you already know it is um, maybe how you see yourself is that you're maybe poor that you don't have enough but you know where the money is or you know how to get more money because the Empress is showing up in the past. So maybe you met someone who can tell you how to make more money. This could be like a coach, this could be someone who gives you advice and can maybe give you advice on how to get more money or how to earn more money. Maybe you have a business and you would like to know how you can scale your business for example then this tarot card combination could be about that um, yeah so you're waiting for something but you think it's not coming up but you have been planting the seeds and i think you will uh, there will something be happening maybe you have been borrowing more money lending money out uh, the seven of swords is showing up together with the knight of pentacles so that means that someone is maybe trying to get away maybe they have been borrowing money but they try to get away with this money and you really try to tell this person all the time like hey can you just uh, pay the money because I need it right now um, this could be one option but it doesn't have to be for everyone who's watching right now it could also be that you just found uh, something that really that you are really going to earn a lot of money with this so maybe there is something or someone in your environment that's helping you with this because the empress is showing up it's showing up at your side but someone else has been hearing this uh, maybe because of this you really need to be careful that it won't be stolen from you because the seven of swords will could be about s stealing so it could be that you have to f yeah you found out finally you have been planting the seeds, you have been working very hard for something and now you know how to uh, get there where you want to be and it doesn't have to be necessarily money it could also be, for example, um, maybe you are into gardening for example, I mean the Empress is, is very much about nature um, if you want to make something beautiful or you are into beauty for example, this is something that um, yeah, could have to do with um, surgery when the King of Swords is showing up. So maybe how to become more beautiful or, or making things more beautiful. Or maybe you like to be in the beauty sector, working in the beauty sector, for example. Uh, I think this definitely has to do something with beauty in, in the past or for a lot of you. Whether this is you or someone else, this kind of beauty is something that... Uh, maybe you in hair business or makeup or you are doing something uh, with people, you're a hairdresser or something like that. Or maybe you have a dream doing something like that. So uh, yeah, so there is maybe already, there was already an opportunity before and this is more something that you did from the mind. Something logical like, hey, if I'm going to do this, it will be like... Uh, complementing the business that I already have or it's complementing the job that I already have right now so this is really like a, a big value someone's bringing value in for you or uh, in a way of knowledge and you need to understand better how to do this um, so I think th there's a lot to learn this week you, I think there's with the Queen of Swords and the Queen, King of Swords in reverse there's a lot to learn um, there could also be 
lies involved because uh, the king of swords in reverse could be about a lie and uh, I think that you know if this is if this is a lie you will know because this is the, the kind of lie that you can um, you can do research on it for example you can just find out if this is true or not because it's about something logical uh, you can find out if one plus one is two <laughs> just remind me of a video on YouTube that uh, a teacher is um, proving that zero is one and one is two <laughs> and I, I found it very funny but uh, in any case the king of swords could be about it could be a teacher it could be someone who is um, getting a little bit more knowledge about something but he's not completely at the moment he doesn't have all the knowledge that he needs and he needs more knowledge so and if you do you are aware of it already you're already aware that you need more knowledge and there are people around you that can help you with this and this is something it's really about knowledge it's not so much about getting right away money or um, selling something immediately but it is really about that knowledge that you need to have the four of cups in reverse shows up together with the nine of swords and the three of pentacles in reverse for the near future so in the middle of the week you maybe you can be bothered doing this maybe you feel a little bit um yeah you feel lethargy or apathy a little like oh yeah this is this is an opportunity but actually i can't be bothered um then this is mostly because you are worried about this, like um, how, maybe how to ask this person or how to deal with this or if you can do it or not. Uh, maybe you're also worrying about something you can do or not because you don't have the knowledge about something. And so you wonder if you can do this or not. Also when you wonder if someone is in a relationship or not, I would say um, you you the way they spoke to you uh, you already know that this person is um, already with someone so the things they said you probably think they already have a partner but you don't know for sure because that's why the king of swords in reverse shows up so you're not sure about it um, and yeah, so you also don't know if they like you or not. I think I, I think you find it very hard to find out if they like you or not, if they love you or like you, because this was really like um, a co a, the connection that you had with this person was really like a mental connection, was something maybe this person was a kind of distance towards you, and so you don't know if they like you or not. Um, when I see these cards, I think that this person. Uh, they take a break they really need rest at the moment I think they they are interested because the page of pentacles is showing up so they they are this is about interest they are interested but it doesn't tell yet that this is some emotional level but they are maybe they need some mental stimulation for example instead of physical or emotional so they need some interesting subjects to talk about or they need to be challenged uh, mentally yeah um, okay if this is a coach this is someone that likes to help you big time because the nine of cups is showing up for them in reverse they really like to help you and yeah they really like to help you and the Six of Cups in reverse together with the Wheel of Fortune and the Judgment Tarot cards could indicate that maybe you maybe you're holding on to the past too much. How things were before. Also in regard to your own your way of seeing yourself. Maybe you can do much more. <laughs> I think you can do much more. It's more that you, you don't have the knowledge. It's not something that you have to be, uh, I don't know, superhero or something. You don't have to be superhero. It's more that it's about knowledge. This is something that everyone that can use their brain, they can do it. So um, everyone actually is capable of doing this certain thing. Uh, or, yeah. Um, when I see these cards, it's probably something everyone can do. Um, 
but you need the knowledge. You need the knowledge first. So the Eight of Cups in reverse together with the Lovers and the Star in reverse shows up. That means that you are about to walk away from something. So maybe someone told you like information like how to get someone back or how to earn more money or how to grow your business. And maybe you're doubting in some way or you think it's a lie or something or you think it's not true or let's see. Nine of Pentacles in reverse with the Fool. Yeah, I think definitely someone really directed you on a, in a way that you, that you know you can get more out of something, what you're already doing, or doing something that's complementing the job that you're already doing, or, or the information or the skills that you're already having, and this is just complementing it. So I think you are in the process that you are going to start a course. There's also a possibility to get self-depend... Um, how do you say that? Independent. <laughs> that you don't are, that you're not dependent anymore financially by someone else. Because I get the Empress and the Nine of Pentacles. There's a new start coming up. When you follow this information, when you are going to understand this information a bit better, definitely there will be something coming up for you that you can be more stable. I also here see in the end of the week I can see the Ace of Wands, the King of Pentacles and the Sun. So that means that maybe you're going to collaborate with someone. Maybe you are in the middle of the week not ready for this and they are also not ready for this. But I think in the end of the week you see opportunities or you are going to approach someone in a very practical, uh, good way that you will help them forward, for example. So there's definitely an opportunity here for you. So that's what I can see for you. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, also check your sun, moon, rising and Venus sign and see you until the next video.